ਆਈ ਆਮ ਚਾਹ ਵੀ So Ernest, how do we meet? Yes, great question. So we met through YouTube, uh, pretty much. I, I stumbled upon some of your initial bag reviews alongside uh, bag maintenance videos. Uh, as I'm a, I'm a Louis Vuitton collector, you know, as much as I work for the company, I'm also uh, you know, a Louis Vuitton collector. I collect uh, bags alongside shoes, as you know, with my channel, and uh, the, the rest is kind of history. So you're stalking me? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're, you're, you're searching my videos. Um, okay, that's cool. And I think you told me that you had a Louis Vuitton yo-yo. So. Yeah, uh, yes, I, I, I do. Uh, so do you like toys? Do you, do you uh, play with toys? Yeah, I, I, I do. I, I'm kind of... I'm kind of one of those people that never want to grow up, so you know I think toys kind of keep keep my uh, youthful spirit alive. Okay. Yeah. I guess. You also like shoes. Yeah. Yeah. I definitely do like. I wore my pink dunks. Ah, uh, you wore your pink dunks. <laughs> Let's go. Is that kind of like a fetish thing? Um, that's a really good question. I don't necessarily think so, but I mean, people can think what they want. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, so the Louis Vuitton yo-yo um, was one of those situations I, I was off I was off that day and uh, well, how to say this I work as a part-time associate at Louis Vuitton in Manila in Manila Philippines and at the time our CEO Keith Carcel was visiting the Philippines and my manager was talking me up as the current Philippine national champion and uh, Eve said I would like to meet him so I they reached out to me and called me on my off day, and I was obviously I was at the post office picking up yo-yos. So I went to work, even though I was off that day, and, and uh, so I suited up wearing my uh, my colleague's suit, even if I didn't have my tie at the time. I still went out and performed, um, and uh, he was amazed by the performance and goes up to me and shakes my hand and takes a photo with me. And he, he says, I, I will help him, is what he says. And uh, the rest is kind of history. Uh, the company commissioned me uh, my own, and the first ever Louis Vuitton yoga. Michelle, you look nice today. Oh, I think I dropped something. <laughs> I'm actually am part of a family, I have nine siblings, so part of a family of ten children. Yeah. Did you like run a farm? Uh, <laughs> no, my, my parents just didn't have cable. Um, um, well, I can ask you, where do you see the direction you're changing? Okay. Yeah, okay. That's a good question, because I started with like kind of a Louis Vuitton expose. To take the judgment out of it is I think my objective with my channel right now is literally taking the judgment out of shopping and fashion. We can all be who we want without, you know, like I don't have any, wait, no, just kidding, my watch. I don't have any movie. <laughs> yeah. Good point. So Michelle, I, I have to ask, uh, what what bag did you bring with you today? So today I have my Furla, which is an Italian brand. Um, so funny thing is that most of my things are influencer gifts, but this is a bag that I actually bought. Totally <laughs> okay. impulsive. I had just hit 8,000 subscribers. And I was walking by the store, and I, this bag just caught my eye. Okay. Because it's pink and it yeah. has flowers. That's amazing. <laughs> and it's so girly. So I actually treated myself to this bag. 
And then it was like soon after that that I just started getting bags. I get bags like probably three a month. Wow. Like, okay. For free. That's amazing. It's a good perk. Yeah. Well, congrats on the bag. And you just hit 20,000 subscribers. I did. Congrats. I did. That's amazing. And guess what? I told my dad. Yeah. And this was his reaction. Okay. <laughs> You know, this is like a blank stare. Filipino dad. Yeah, okay. The, the next question out of his, the next question probably in his head was, are you a doctor yet? Great yeah. Job. So for, for, for context, like, I, I don't know, my family, you can only be a doctor, an engineer, well, it's the third, doctor, a uh, nurse, lawyer. or engineer, lawyer. or lawyer, right? So, <laughs> uh, Filipinos don't have any other options. Uh, Occupations. Uh, a YouTuber is like what he's not. Pretty much. Yeah, so that was my dad's reaction. I mean, you, you know, coming from the Philippines, we're all about family and food. It's it's a big thing. It's yeah. it's it's, it's, it's uh, the meaning of life. So so uh, so yeah, I think uh, that's really what it kind of came down to: is spending time with family and having amazing food. Why, that's why we're at Jolly right now. 